But all of these jewelry shops, they sell real gold jewelry, 18 carats and 24 carats, but luckily they're still closed. This is what we call narrow. Yes. Okay. Okay. We're going. You can't be fat to walk through here. Fat people, they need to find the house on the main street. <laughs> Hello, Zach. Oh, there he's way back. Oh. Wow. This heated clay pot with fire with it. She's working the dough with her hand and uh, mixing it with the olive oil. Okay, the olive oil. And she works it all by hand and she tries to make it as thin as a paper. And she sprays it over this clay pot. She ends up getting the, this kind of uh, dough here that is being dyed. And the dyeing process takes place inside the workshop to the right or left hand side. But after the dye process, they need to wash all what they have dyed using clean water in that spring or in that fountain down there to the left hand side. Now please, all the wasted water ends up into the river and the river is running right behind this dyer. For lunch, it was so sad. And welcome to our veterans of the oldest tenant in Morocco. For the explanation, you have three choices Moroccan English, Arabic, or Berber. The letter from this little house, the first thing that we should do here, we should first even keep the letter in the white vessels with water and because it is a pigeon waste, there is the ammonia. Yeah. And That's the why ammonia it smells like that. Pigeon waste makes it a soft. And what we are looking now is a dying art. Why dying art? Like in our factory, for example, next year for people they are going to leave. Why? Some of the decoration in our country, of course, that we talk about the Moroccan style is more round than circles like this one. 